It's Dear Unopener. Let's go. Let's go. Dude, we got the YouTube channel going. <laughs> Firefly Kyle here. It's, well, let's say it's early in the morning and we're going on Minnesota Deer Opener here, but we got darkness. We got cold. Should be a good morning anyway. We're, we're about to head out there. We'll check in with you when we get out there. We got Cousin Kurt here with us too, so that should be good. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> you heard that right. Steer hunt opener, 2023. Boys are ready to go. And we're all here doing a little individual vlog hunting today for deer hunt opener. I'm amped up. I love deer hunting. We got the stuff ready to go. What is up, guys? I'm out in the woods. Walking in right about now. I got like five minutes to my stand, not even. It's open in the morning. I already passed a guy in the crowd blind over there. This is a horrible idea because now I'm not going to be able to see in the woods, but... Let's get after it. I'm gonna get to my stand cut about like an hour before shooting light yet. We gonna get after it. Hopefully she gets greasy. Here we are in the stand again. It's about 20 minutes before shooting time here, so we gotta be quiet. We're gonna get down. We got we got our bow. I shoot with the, I hunt with a bow. I just I, I think it's more fun, but I got the GoPro here. Hopefully we can get some cool get some nice footage for you guys, but don't mind the snot you know it's it's cold and a long long warm walk get it going but all right here we go see you guys when the sun comes up it's like 10 minutes after shooting light i think no action no action so far but i'm glass i'm glass which way which way i gotta stay down Check it with Gumby and Donkey here, and we'll, we'll see what they got going. I think Donkey already saw one deer today. So guys, checking in, doing a midday update here. It's 9.20 in the morning, I guess. Not a midday update, but I just had a block, a little spike of four pointer. all year but now I'm deer hunting him. I think I could hit him with a slug or is that frowned upon maybe got a lot of shooting on the state land over here so hopefully they'll get in a buck here soon push it right to me it's gonna come right in there bah, bah, bah. we'll check back we'll check back that's right that's nice. look at that oof she's a big old A little bit of action, a lot of shooting around. 
Had some shots that way, shots that way. Nobody in our party. You know, I figured we'll eat some, we'll eat some sandwich here. It's about 10. Probably hang out for, I don't know, 30 minutes to an hour. Go home, watch some college football. Got some bets rolling. Post those up. Um, otherwise, yeah, we'll chill for a bit. And we're gonna hit back out here. I'm not an all-day sitter. I'm gonna go, go home, chill for a bit. I let the dog out, but we got some action this morning. Love to see it. Oh, hope the big boy's moving tonight. But, anyways, hope you guys are shooting them up, and we'll see you eventually. to action just had we had uh one deer come out of the field over there probably about 150 200 yards away and then that was about 20 minutes ago and just a little bit ago i saw a couple deer come running out there I saw one deer two deer three deer also i'm like damn what the hell seen him running along this tree line uh they look like all doe three or four doe got some good footage of them but uh Hopefully the bucks follow. We got some action though. We're gonna take off around 11, but I think I'm gonna keep sitting for a while. We'll see, we'll see. Best of luck, let's go. This is the best kind right here. This is deer stand snack. If you ain't got Skittles, man, what are you doing? Marshawn Lynch would be pissed, all right? Come on. Purple Skittles, get on it. Gotta be wild deer. We're in the wild, so gotta have wild deer. What's up, guys? Just checking in. Leaving the woods here, 
saw lots of lots of deer. More doe than bucks, but hey, saw a small buck. And it's about 11:30. Gonna go let the dog out, get some food, watch some football for a bit. I think Slotic's sitting all day. Kyle wrapped up at about 8:30, so you know, Rudder. I think Rudder's dialing up some bets right now. Win some cash, you know, all that fun stuff. But we'll be back out. A lot of promising action. Boys should be uh, getting on him here, hopefully. But stay tuned. We'll see you when we come back out. It's about 12:15 right now. Only six more hours to go. Getting the phone juiced up. Hopefully, gonna leave it on this mount for most of the night. I didn't have it in the mount earlier when that spike came in. As I told you, I was on it, so I did try and put it in there, but I, I thought it was a doe. So I was like, I better just grab the gun and get that, that'd be more important to shoot the deer than get it on film, but at the same time, I'm, I'm, what am I out here for? Content or me in the freezer? Ideally both, but the meat comes first. I want the meat. Doing better than I thought though on this all day sit. It's actually quite peaceful today. Doc, you can come here probably inside eating some food right now, warming up or something. They keep telling me I'm gonna love their content, so. I mean, obviously I'll have seen it by the time that you guys are seeing this video, but <laughs> I'm excited to go home and edit that. 12.30, right on the dot. Having a little snack here, a little Rice Krispie bar. Gotta get that scent out there. I don't bring them in. What are you guys eating in your stand? So I was video on Facebook yesterday from Shields and uh, Gus Phillips said that he needs some skittles on the stand and I'm really kicking myself that I didn't get those. So thanks Gus if you're watching for putting that thought in my mind all day. Then again, I probably would have had the wrapper out here all day. I'd have been messing with it. But those would hit right now too. Those would taste pretty darn good. Never updated you from the morning hunt, but we didn't see anything else. We came in about 11 o'clock and didn't see a darn thing. You know, kids show, gotta keep it darn. But now here we are, it's about three o'clock in the afternoon, just getting ready here in the garage. Head out, what do you think, Pooch? She doesn't have much faith tonight for tonight either, so. Well, we're gonna hope for the best and we're gonna give her a shot, we'll see you out there. 3.30 in the afternoon now, we've been out. We've been sitting here for a few minutes now, but it's warm out here, it's about 50 degrees or so. Here we can shoot till about 6.30, so. Got about three hours yet of shooting time here, so. Give you a little update in a little bit. The all day sit's going well. Times are passing a lot faster than I thought it would actually. If you got anything ever to think about, I'd highly recommend it. Just go out and sit in the woods all day. You'll figure it out. It's pretty peaceful, but seems like Donkey's back in his stand. Just got a snap from him. Bop in his return right here. Well, we arrived for the night hunt. Well, hope for a good sit. Let's get on some deer. Hope they're moving like this morning. It's a little windier, a little warmer, so we'll see. But good luck. We'll see you guys eventually. It's about 5.30 now. We got about an hour left of shooting light here. And uh, we haven't seen anything yet, but it's getting closer to that prime time here. Just thought I'd give you guys a little update. But Well, finished up the hunt. Saw, saw one doe. Came running through the the outside of the weeds but other than that not much not much but hey saw something again so that's promising um heading back get a good night's sleep and let's get back after it tomorrow we gotta push the clocks back forward i don't even know an hour earlier i gotta get up so that's awesome but hey maybe see you guys tomorrow peace oh. as the sun sets on day one over there all day sit. One spiked buck. That's about all I saw. Maybe I shouldn't have passed it, but let him go, let him grow, I suppose. We'll be back in the morning anyway. Learned a lot today. Uh, I don't really have much else right now. I'm gonna head back to the truck and maybe we'll hear from the other two. If not, I probably already cut it in, but if not, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Well, here we are, day two of the Minnesota deer opener and I don't know if it's really a deer opener because I use a bow anyway but 
you know, you get a lot of people rutsy, you know, you got the rut going, you got a lot of people pushing deer around, but we we'll just see if we can't get it done today here in southern Minnesota and we'll just see what happens. We'll see you out there and let's hope for the best. What is up? I'm farther away from the stand today to hopefully talk a little bit, but day two. This is a horrible idea. I gotta walk even farther today and now I'm really not gonna be able to see. Um we're gonna get after it. I don't know if we're gonna sit all day again. Kinda feel like it, but I'm hoping we get a deer early in the morning and then we can go get some food and come back early too, so that's the plan. We'll see you in the stand. We're about an hour into shooting time and about five minutes before shooting time I saw a little fawn ran right underneath my stand and she was being chased by a coyote. And I tried to shoot the coyote but I couldn't really see the thing so but that deer went south and the coyote went north so deer escaped that encounter and coyotes go hungry tonight but one of my cousins down the way, they shot, shot once, I don't know if they got anything or hit it, but there went the one deer in this entire county, so now's a good time to take a nap, so that's when you see the most, that's when the most deer come by, you know, when you're taking a nap, you're sitting completely still and making no noise, nothing, so you just gotta keep your ears open and take a nap, it's a good, good way to kill some time, so we're just gonna do that. What's your strategy for open snacks on the deer stand? How do I get this thing open without it making any noise? Oh, fuck. 12 pointer probably just ran away. A shout out to my girlfriend. I was talking last night like, oh, maybe I'll have him need a couple snacks for the stand. She showed up with half a dollar general, so. If I put on weight, that's why. Definitely her fault. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't bring snacks in the deer stand. Or I just smash them some summer sausage. You know you gotta wash it down. Here, dear, dear, dear. Here, dear, 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 dear. Here, dear, here, dear. I'll check it with the other guys. I'm going crazy over here this morning. Well guys, update from the tree, uh, it's 8 o'clock, haven't seen crap, I um, actually saw some geese flying by, but other than that, not too much, so uh, I'm just going to hang on, you know, got a football game starting in a half hour, can't beat that, so hey, we're watching, we're waiting, just keep your eyes peeled because uh, you never know what's out there. Saw a couple deer down the way. Looked like they were coming this way. I've lost them in the trees, but there's an old railroad bed right over here that they like to walk down. So we're gonna see if they uh, we're gonna see if they come on down this old railroad bed and see if we can't get a shot at them. We're gonna hope that they come this way. They're out to the west of us now. There's three of them. They were out here on the sod field out there. So they took off. They took off west. Tails up in the air. I don't know what got them going, but something did. Now they're just running around. Buck chasing over a coyote, or they saw somebody, or, or smelled something. I don't know, but it's gotta be quiet. You gotta keep watching. It's gotta be quiet. You never know when those deer are gonna roll in. Hate hearing shots around me. Why can't it be me? <coughs> Shh. Shut up. He's fucking staring me down. What do you want, dude? Are you the government? Well guys, we're headed out. Ah, uh, didn't see a lick of a deer today. The squirrel was back fighting with me today, this pesky squirrel, but that's about it. Uh, yeah, you know, you're not gonna see them all the time, especially deer, those, uh, those guys are smart. Sneaky, it's a little windy. Uh, we're gonna go, it's about 11 o'clock, so we're gonna head up, go home, watch some Vikings football. And then uh, get back out here and I'm feeling good. And that afternoon hunt's gonna bring us some luck. And uh, yeah, you know, I am on, live to see another day, another hunt. Me and the old girl will be back, so cheers. See you in the afternoon. Let's go. Well, day two, afternoon hunt. 
I don't know. I don't know what to think. Kind of down in the dumps. Don't have much hope yet left, even though it's early in the season. But I just keep thinking about that spike buck I passed. It's good for the population to let it go, but for me wanting meat, it ain't good. Like, that don't help. I'm going to hopefully get my stand. Hopefully they're still walking around. Maybe they'll kick something to me. That's kind of the hope. Hopefully other people just kick a deer to me. Then we're going to put that thing in my freezer. Alright. I'm going to go get the stand. I'll probably talk with you guys there. You see it up there? Made it to the stand. Hey, just watch the bike secure a dub. Big dub for the Vikings. Alright, let's hope it's our turn tonight, alright? Uh, it's about seven, 17, 18 mile an hour winds, they say. Um, well, luckily, we're in a little, we're in a woods funnel here, so hoping this funnel will produce tonight. We'll get the bucks rolling through it and uh, have traveling on their way wherever they're going. We'll hope to see them, but anyways, carry on. We'll see you up in the stand. Waiting for the tree. What's good? Uh, one thing I noticed, I plowed the field over there. Picked it, not plowed it, sorry. There was corn in there this morning. Now it's gone, so we'll see how that changes up the spot here. I kind of liked it with the corn. Give the deer a place to hide. Now, I guess maybe that opens up a woods for them to hide in. So, we'll see if they want to come in. Now, stay tuned. I say stay tuned a lot, I think. But, stay tuned. Well, we've got a little under an hour of shooting light left. And it's not looking promising. I haven't seen anything all day. If you guys watch this far with no action, that, that we appreciate it, but it's tough out here. Stuff like this just makes me wonder how they say there's a three deer limit this year, but there's no deer. I better be quiet now. We'll wait out this last hour. I'll talk to you guys later. If it looks like I'm not looking at the camera, I'm sorry. I'm glassing out here. Wonder where the deer at, you know. I think I'm just gonna give up hunting. What's up guys? Checking in here. A beautiful Sunday night. Look at that sky. I don't know if you can see it. She's setting nicely. We got about 30 minutes left of shooting light. So we're gonna hunker down here. Hope something comes in. We haven't seen much today, so hope our luck changes, but if not, we got plenty of time left. We love the hunt, we love the grind. So let's keep after it and we'll see when we see when the big monsters are coming or do. Let's go. warm and windy out here so I'm not expecting too much out here but that'll, that's pretty much going to wrap it up for the opening weekend here of Minnesota firearm season down here in southern Minnesota it's November 5th this year so I haven't seen much saw one right away when I got in my stand today in this warm and wind my brother must have kicked it up when he was getting into his stand and just came running down here and other than that, not a thing, not, not even too many squirrels out here tonight, but man, we got a beautiful sunset over here. <gasps> Let's go, be it. Buck, I mean, it's not a very big buck, but holy man, I mean, it looked like about to be a little eight pointer, and we, we smoked him. I mean, it was about a 10 yard shot, it wasn't far, but we got him a little action, a little upset. I just turned the, took the GoPro down. I mean, it was pretty dark anyway, but let's go, baby. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Let's go, baby. Go down low, like this video, and subscribe down below. Let's go, come on. I'm back at the truck. No action for me today, but you know, this is how hunting goes, I guess. Um, pretty down about it, needed me, didn't get her done, but just got a Snapchat from old Gumby. And he might have a deer down. 10 yard shot he says smacked it with the bow and arrow even though it's slug season he's still out there with the bow so i'm gonna go meet him up at his house luckily it's just for me it's just right on the way home anyway so i'm gonna stop there talk to him he's getting some grub right now then we're gonna go find this deer you boys better hold on tight and girls and girls sorry damn guys no dice no deer no nothing not even an animal the squirrel wasn't even around today 
Um, we, we didn't have much luck. I think it's just too damn windy. But hey, good thing is there's not no shots around, so you know no one's really shooting. That's always a plus. That means we got the whole week to go pop something. Hopefully, not many people are out hunting, and, uh, and then we'll we'll benefit. So let's rock and roll. We're gonna go home, eat some soup, and uh, just relax. Watch some Sunday night football. Let's get it. We out. We'll see you tomorrow. Where's it at? It's out in the woods yet. We're, we gotta get <laughs> pumped up. We gotta play some some music here. We got we gotta get pumped up a little bit. Well, we're in the back. Let's go track it. Hopefully, it didn't run too far. Arrow went clean through, full of blood, so it should be good. Fingers crossed. You know, stay tuned to see this thing. We're going to get this deer. Let's go get this deer, baby. We'll check back <laughs> when we find it. Spot. We're gonna go see. We got my bow, got the arrow up there yet, and we're gonna start tracking here pretty quick. Ho 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 ho. It's about a 10 yard shot. There's a stand right there. He came right down this trail here. Came in perfectly. I'm not seeing any blood. Hey! You got blood over here. There's one right here. Now nah, we're flipping. Good pile there. Right here. Yeah, there's more. Right here. That's what you said. Don't want him to get up. Yeah, we don't have anything to shoot him with. Looks like he's done. Oh yeah, blood coming out pretty good. Good job, that's good there sight here. Go. Let's go baby, it ain't big, oh. but he, he eats. As Blake Slotic would say, that's protein right here. That's protein. <laughs> Pure protein. Nice size deer, dude. That thing's got a big body. Nice. It's on the downfall, it's on the downfall, trust me. <laughs> I know deer, this thing's on the downfall. Eight year old buck? Yeah, eight and a half at least. This is it. I got another doe tag yet though, let's go. We got one down, whole week to go. We got seven days to go yet, but one down, we're gonna keep going. Sodic's still looking for that one. He's he's probably gonna take a few days off work. He's itching. He's been sitting all day, but he's itching. But for now, I don't know, I, I lost it. We'll I talk lost to you it. next week. Yeah. yeah, we'll see you next time, you know. Stay tuned for part two for the rest of the season. Remember, subscribe down below, like this video, leave a comment if you want, I don't know. Do something. <laughs>